Hey, what's going on, everybody? It is Gully here. Welcome back to uh, a bit of a different video. A little while back, there was an article posted on Polytopia's news feed that said that Google is teaching DeepMind to play Polytopia. Okay, wh what does all that mean? Oh, we're going to go ahead and get into it. First, I just want to read you guys the article. Google teaches DeepMind to play Polytopia, now challenging AI as well as Brainiacs. June 20th, 2021. Now it's time for a new challenger, as DeepMind's AI is to take on Swedish indie developer Mijiwan's The Battle of Polytopia. The game is now a part of Google-owned DeepMind's open-ended platform Android ENV, or ENV, I actually don't know. The Battle of Polytopia continues to challenge clever gamers around the world. Now it's time to test AI as an opponent on DeepMind's open-ended platform for Android apps and games. We are, of course, very happy about this. DeepMind is a giant within AI with a fantastic platform that we are very proud and excited to be a part of, said Christian L Ooh. Swedish Lovsted. I'm sorry, that's definitely wrong. <laughs> We have noticed that Polytopia is particularly popular among so-called brainiacs, but this will be the start of something completely new when we are taking on artificial intelligence. There's a bit more information on the founders of the company and how it came into Google's possession, and some screenshots of the AI playing the game. We'll get more into that later. Okay, but what exactly is DeepMind? Well, funnily enough, their website has those answers. We're a team of scientists, engineers, machine learning experts, and more, working together to advance the state of the art in AI. Our long-term aim is to solve intelligence, developing more general and capable problem-solving systems, known as Artificial General Intelligence, or AGI. Guided by safety and ethics, this invention could help society find answers to some of the world's most pressing and fundamental scientific challenges. So they're focused around advancing AI and using it to solve problems. Okay, so what about this Android ENV that was mentioned briefly? Well, it's an open source platform for reinforcement learning research built on top of the Android ecosystem. Android ENV allows RL agents to interact with a wide variety of apps and services commonly used by humans through a universal touchscreen interface. Since agents train on realistic simulation of an Android device, they have the potential to be deployed on real devices. So they basically talk about how this framework could be used to do everyday tasks by an AI, like making phone calls, Googling stuff, basically pretty cool. The thing that interests me is towards the bottom. We're also excited to have started a collaboration with Mijiwan, creators of the Battle of Polytopia, to integrate their game as an Android ENV task. We find this game a particularly interesting challenge due to many of its features, such as the need to handle long-term planning, imperfect information, diverse UI elements, and non-determinism. Following this, there's some video of the AI actually playing the game. Bouncing over to Mijiwan's Twitter, we see the same video. It is captioned, This is at DeepMind AI playing Polytopia for real. Let's watch the video. So we can see basically exactly what the AI is seeing, which is pretty neat. It moves its starting warrior, researches hunting on turn zero, and then, you know, ends its turn. Then on turn two, it has four stars. It could upgrade the capital, but it decides not to. And then it captures the city and researches organization. So everything about that was, you know, wrong. But it's an AI. It has to train. I'm guessing, you know, it hasn't done that yet. A little side note, somebody asked about the bot difficulty improving, and Mijiwan said, yes, the bots in alpha testing are pretty hard to beat at the moment. So we are getting more difficult AI at some point. Okay, why is any of this important? Why am I telling you any of this? Why am I making a video on this topic? I personally just find the whole having an AI learn to play Polytopia thing extremely fascinating. Pretty much whenever I got Polytopia, I had always wondered what it would look like if an actual AI making the biggest brain plays could ever play this game and, you know, what it would look like and what sort of stuff it would do. So it's an extremely fascinating topic to me. And I'm also just thinking, like, what new strategies are we going to see thanks to watching an AI play the game? It might pull some stuff out of its butt that none of us have even thought of before. But yeah, it will be really cool to see what this AI does. I'm not sure if we're going to get the opportunity to play it, but that would be be awesome as well. That would make for a super cool video, I think. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this. I don't know what you would call this. Is it a news video? Update video? I don't know. I just think it's cool. Hope you guys did enjoy. Hope you thought it was cool too. Looking forward to the future. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to hit the like button down below. Subscribe for more Polytopia content. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a spectacular day.